In this video, we will discuss Rafsim disease. And after the video, we will discuss important points from examination point of view. So, what's Rafsim disease? It's a slowly progressive autosomal recessive hypertrophic demyelinating sensory motor neuropathy with anosmia, cerebellar ataxia, retinitis pigmentosa, and an increase in CSF protein. So what's the cause of Rafsim disease? Defective oxidation of phytanic acid leads increased level of the phytanic acid which is toxic. So what's phytanic acid? Phytanic acid is a branch chain fatty acid found in dairy products, beef, lamb, fish and some green leafy vegetable which contains phytol. So what's the defect in Rafsim disease? The mitochondrial peroxisomes normally break down this fatty acid but mutation in the gene disrupts the breakdown of the fatty acid leading to buildup of excess amounts of phytanic acid which is toxic to the cell. All patients have elevated serum phytanic acid. Onset is in early childhood or adolescence but may be delayed to 4th or 50k. So what organ systems are involved? CNS, I, is skin and joints and heart. So what abnormalities in the CNS? Anosmia, ataxia and sensory neural deafness. What are the features in the eye? Night blindness due to retinitis pigmentosa and retinitis pigmentosa may be the earliest feature and also the patient has cataract. Features in his skin. His skin is dry and thick ichthyosis syndactyly and shortening of the fourth toe. In the heart there is cardiomyopathy and cardiac arrhythmias. Ataxia and dry skin may appear later in life. There are high plasma and urinary level of phytanic acid and CSF proteins are elevated. So what's the treatment? Treatment is restriction of animal fats and milk products and also green leafy vegetable that contains phytol. So the important point that is Rafsim disease is a hypertrophic demyelinating sensory motor neuropathy. There is defective oxidation of phytanic acid due to mutation in the gene. Skin is thick ichthyosis. There is syndactyly and shortening of the fourth row. Treatment is restriction of animal fats and milk products and also green leafy vegetable which contain phytoin.